three months out of practice, but I feel like them told in at the back of an army. I don't know if I should move them. No, I'm at them stay in my bathroom. Well, once God, welcome back to the channel. I hope you guys missed me because I missed you. I missed you. I keep on coming back with excuses. Guys, God, no. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what's wrong with me. We just, we just don't know what's wrong with me. But I'm trying. I'm trying. Just that deal with me. But first of all, I just want to let y'all know. School done. Them let me go. <laughs> them let me go. I feel free. And the first couple of days after I'm done, I never know what I'm doing myself. So <laughs> here I am. Like literally, I've, every minute, I'm not going to think about, oh my God, I'm not going to worry about my thesis. I'm not going to worry about school or whatever. And new things are happening, which I'm, I'm going to share with you guys. But this is not the video. This is not the video for it. This video is about me trying to retwist my hair. In my hair video, I told you guys that um, I do interlock. But right now my hair looks a little fuzzy and unkept and I don't like that. So I am going to try to retwist. I don't know if this is going to be a constant routine of mine where I will just retwist my hair and then interlock it when it's long enough, like enough growth. But at this point, it's a mess, it dry. It won't wash. <laughs> so that's what I'm gonna do. I'm going to wash my hair and I'm going to try to retwist it for the first time. And I see a lot of people using just water and oil and that's what I'm going to try try because again i've never done it before i have these clips to help hold my hair in place technically this is aloe vera juice mixed diluted with a little bit of water and this is some jamaican black castor oil with a little bit of tea tree oil in it i am four months into my lock journey i can't tell when last i relock i relock my hair like interlock it so i don't know i wanted to record that video for you guys but circumstances beyond my control um i do want to give you guys a lot count but i probably do that in another video and hopefully it's soon so let me go wash my hair and we can get started my hair is now freshly washed and this is how it is looking if you guys have seen my previous video let me know if you think it grew i don't know if it grew or not but let's just let me know if you think it grow. Hopefully this doesn't take a long time. I'm really not up to sit here hours and hours at a time. But I am going to see how long it's going to take me. So currently it is 6.28. Let's call it 6.30. I am going to start off with the back. But as I'm going to show you my kitchen real quick. As you can see, I want to see if I can catch these loose hairs at the back. It's a whole mess. My hair is already dry, so I'm just going to spritz it a little bit with the aloe vera and water. And then I'm just going to go through my roots and apply the oil. And then I'm going to massage it after, and if I need to add more oil, so I'll do that. I was scared to lock my hair because I know my edges were thin, and I was scared that locking my hair would pull on my edges. Okay, so now that I've done that, I'm just going to go ahead and put it up in the ponytail and attempt to do this retwist. First one. I can't sit back there, so I don't know what that looks like. Hopefully that holds it. Again, I don't want it to stay long or anything. I just want it to look a little bit neater and hold me over. And as you can see, it does need a little bit of taming, but I'm gonna do that at my next um, interval. So that's one row down and it seems to be staying so
some point I really forgot which way I was supposed to twist but you can see right here I paused for a really long time thinking about what some of them I did twist the wrong way but I guess that's completely fine because I'm still going to interlock in the future finished twisting all my hair it's currently 7 31 so it took me exactly an hour to do this which wasn't isn't too bad so i am going to tie my hair down with the clips in and see if i can actually sleep with them in tonight and take it out tomorrow when my hair is dry after i take it out tomorrow i'll come and show you guys what it looks like but again this is not something i expect to stay forever i just want my hair to look a little groom than how it did before so that I can you know film some other videos without looking crappy and popped up I'll catch you guys tomorrow to show you the final results hey what to do what to do what to do it's the next day anyways I'm about to take the clips out and see how well this fared overnight the sleep wasn't bad but I feel like some of them will cook up some type of way that they hold but my hair just cock up right I don't know hopefully I don't get the boot sweat but I need to my hair need to lie down it <laughs> can't stay like this so I'm just gonna sweat the length of my hair and see if it can just lie down properly I'm gonna soak it or anything I brought that look of life in it, it still look neat. It's a little dark, isn't it? One second. Sorry for the darkness. But I just realized. Anyways, that's how the water retus came out. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Leave a comment down below letting me know what else you would like to see. I'm gonna show you guys how to use the crochet needle to get instant locks pretty soon. And then I'll start posting my older videos, hopefully. Anyways, that's it for the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to bust a like and subscribe down below. Also, click the post notification bell to know whenever I do post a new video. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!